guess just uh, reflecting on your first season at wide receiver, what, what were some things that you, you liked that you did, and, and how do you want to improve on uh, just being a receiver? I guess. Um, my first season, I just just try to take in everything that I could, just keep listening, like kind of be a sponge and stuff like that. Um, I feel like I kind of caught the ball well. Uh, just keep just keep working on that too. But, yeah. So what's been your biggest focus the last couple months, just as you try to become more comfortable in the position, try to improve at receiver? Uh, getting out of my breaks is really something that's big for me, because like switching position stuff is kind of you're not used to that. So just working on that, uh, just getting out of breaks and everything, staying flexible and all that. So. How much different has this spring been than last year? Now that you have a year under your belt at the position. Uh, this year I'm way more comfortable, you know, like even with the playbook, uh, alignment, like what a, a receiver is supposed to do, kind of. So I'm kind of just coming into my own at that position. Looks like you're physically a little bit leaner, like you dropped some weight. Was that by design? And I guess what was what was the idea behind that? Uh, so last year I just felt like I was too heavy, like I felt like I couldn't run. So this year I kind of just dropped my body fat and like worked on my flexibility and stuff like that and just kept learning how to run and stuff. What all, what all went into that, like in terms of changing diet and working out, like what, how did you, how were you able to kind of make that change? Uh, just talking to Coach Wellman and the staff and our nutritionist Isaac, just just making sure I'm uh, eating the right things, like having the right diet and stuff and it yeah, just like monitoring my, my uh, weight and things like that. So. Have you noticed a difference out here? I mean, do you feel like you're quicker, a little bit faster? I mean, just moving better overall? Yeah, definitely. I just, I feel like I kind of, uh, like dropping body fat and like body weight, it just, it really helped me just be a, like, with, with being able to get out of braces, things like that. So. How much weight did you lose or body fat percentage, I guess, do you know? The, I lost well, about eight pounds, something like that. Not all of that, I'm just, <laughs> right. I'm just like eight pounds. Right. Do, do you know what body fat you have before? It's uh, I, was about, I was at 10, I think. Now I'm at like seven or eight. So. What's it been like uh, working with uh, Coach Tucker? Uh, he's he's just, he's really a, like he's gonna make sure you get, get everything like right. Like he gonna, he's gonna make sure you do everything correctly. Um, he's gonna coach you extremely hard. He's not gonna let you be lazy or loathe, none of that, so. I like I like Coach Coach Tucker. Like he just he just pushes you to the max. You kind of lit up when he talk. You kind of lit up when when he asked that question. What's your relationship like with Coach Tucker? Uh, when he first got here, he was just he was kind of quiet. Like he didn't really say much. He just kind of coached, did his job a little bit. But now, like he really kind of gets on us. And in the meeting rooms and stuff, we laugh a lot now. And you know, we're just we're just coming closer and closer. When you switched to receiver, who were some of your teammates that mentored you through that process? Um, Camp Camper, he's a big one. Like I like to watch Cam because Cam is kind of my size, so we kind of like move alike. And I just try to take like certain releases from him and certain moves from Cam. When you just uh, talk about your diet, like is there anything that you kind of had to cut out? And were there more food, or are there different foods now that you eat more than you did before? Uh, I was I was kind of a bigger like a big sweets guy, so I had to cut out a little bit a little bit of that, and then. Uh, just eating chicken and rice, that's a really big thing for me. I like chicken and rice a lot. <laughs> so what, what sweets did you have, or try to win? Really just like a lot of candy and stuff. Like what time? Like Skittles maybe. <laughs> <laughs> so. Is that hard for you? Make that change? Not really, not bad. What's your impression been with, the, with all the quarterbacks this spring? Uh, they're, they're doing good, they just keep progressing every day. Um, it's a battle right now, so. We just have to wait till spring, till spring's over, just to see who's gonna come out with that top spot. When, when you talk about uh, just being like more comfortable, like, is there any moments that stand out of like, whether it be on the field in the film room where like you felt like you had just got something like quicker or you just it, it just came easier, I guess. Um, releases, like so last year it just like I wasn't really good at releases, uh, but this year I'm kind of like I take more time working on them, like after practice and with other guys like Cam, Camper, and uh, Cam Perry. So. Is there a favorite route you have? Uh, my favorite route? Uh, of course, it's a fade ball, but uh, I like digs. I like anything. It doesn't really matter. What's been your impression of uh, EJ Williams coming in? Uh, EJ, is, he's, he's, a, he's a guy, for real. Uh, he's, 
we're kind of the same size too, so like we kind of play alike. Uh, I, I kind of think of him as like my twin on the other side, really. So, yeah. What do you think of like you got you have him, yourself, Cam, kind of taller guys? Just how, how do you think that can impact the offense? Just having three kind of taller receivers. Uh, I feel like we'll have a lot of mismatch, like mismatches with the uh, the high wide, like high wise and stuff like that. So yeah, just, that'll that'll be a, it'll be a lot of mismatches and stuff. What is your impression for guys? Impressions of Taven just been working with him this spring. Well, Taven's really good. Like he he has a great ball. Uh, really is catchable. Uh, after practice and stuff like that, we we really work like on routes and stuff. Well, before spring started, we were working on routes and just catching and getting our chemistry together. So I have really good chemistry with uh, Taven. All right, Don. Thanks, Thanks bro. Thanks. Thanks. Appreciate it.